Let's get rid of Rumble! Let's get rid of Rumble! I'm not going to include that, I hope. That's gonna be all good. Hi guys! Sorry, I didn't realise this was a kids show. Jesus Christ. So in today's video, I thought I would bring you along to watch me bake some cupcakes. I'm going to be baking them for my entire street. Well, most of them. Before we get started, I just want to put it out there. I'm not a baker. I'm not a chef. I am not exactly gifted in the kitchen expertise. So this could go horribly wrong. So if you're looking at this as a tutorial, probably not a good idea. So let's get cracking. I say cracking too much. How do you even start? making cupcakes. I've never made cupcakes by myself. First look at a recipe. We're gonna do muffins. No, we're doing cupcakes. No muffins. Do you know the muffin man? Don't quote Shrek. Note to self, don't quote Shrek. Also a shout out to my awesome shoes. Cupcake recipe, that's easy. You can't really say, can you? But they look like cupcakes. Gotta love BBC food recipes. Prep 20 minutes, cook 15. It serves 12. <laughs> do I double it? Do I make 24? Or do I half a double it? So it makes 18. We're doing 18. So ingredients, softened butter. We have margarine, it's all good. Golden caster sugar. We have caster sugar. It's white. Two large eggs. Eggs. Oh, vanilla extract. Mm, do I have vanilla extract? That's Tabasco. We don't want Tabasco. Desperate measures. I mean, desperate precautions. I don't know if that makes sense. Oh, oh Nothing happened. Oh, I found the vanilla extract. Sherlock Holmes. Mm. Self-raising flour. Self-raising flour. Put buttercream, softened butter, margarine, icing sugar. It's up there. Just take my word for it. Vanilla extracts again. Milk. It's in the fridge. Food colouring. We, we don't need food colouring, that's fine! Step one, heat oven. We'll, we'll do that later. This is probably gonna take a while. Step two, using an electric whisk. But I don't have an, an electric whisk. Do I even have a whisk? Oh, I do. I have a manual one. Beat 110 grams of softened butter. We're making 18, so 50, 55. 165 grams, ladies and gentlemen. Knife! What you got there? A knife! Insert vine here. And let me see what you have! A knife! No! 165. Now that's 93. That's 177, too much! That's 166, that'll be okay. Oh my god, this is going to be a messy one. 110 grams of golden caster sugar. So the same again, 165 grams. I had to literally just run to the shop to get caster sugar. Ah, it's heavy. I don't know if I'm doing this right. Oh no, that's a bit much. Oh, exactly 165 now. Okay, we need to beat it. You can't beat with a whisk, right? You're telling me to use a whisk. Hell no, are we using my good old wooden spoon? Do I know how to beat something? No, not unless it's my sister. Sorry, Kaylin. To be fair, this isn't working. She used to beat me more than I used to beat her. But as you know, older siblings always get the blame. So if you're watching, Kaylin, I fuck you. I can't beat for the love of my life. Seriously. Bakers, if you're watching this, I'm so sorry. I'm tired as well. I made the mistake of doing a workout right before I filmed this video. So I am shattered not doing why. It's like, what's the time? Oh my God, it's 20 past five. See, I am not a chef by any means. 
baker, I mean. I was meant to be a musician, not a chef. What can I say? That looks amazing. Scrummy, scrumptious, am I right? Smells like nothing. What is the next step? Then whisk two eggs one at a time, scraping down the side of the bowl after each addition. <laughs> Don't get the challenge. Right, we have to whisk now. God, Albert. That has a weird noise. Egg number two. Ah, I didn't get the challenge. It's all Gucci. Don't get shallin. Shit, I got a bit of shallin. Oh, that's disgusting. It's fine, I got it out. Whisk, whisk, whisk some more shallin. Maybe doing this wrong. How does that look? Is this meant to look like that? Right, that's good. Step three, I think. Who knows? Add half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. That'd be two thirds, right? No, it'd be three quarters. Oh, who cares about three quarters? I'm just doing one. Because you can never have too much vanilla. Whoa, it smells like. Oh, you know what would be nice? A vanilla cocktail. Add 110 grams of self raising flour and a pinch of salt. Have my bowl out ready to measure 165 grams of self raising flour. Lovely. Right, we'll do 120 first. Oh, I may fit it in the whole bowl. A few moments later. Oh, finally, that's excellent, man. Where's my sieve? Shit, there's the sieve. I made a banging grilled cheese last night. Just wanna let you guys know. Look how cool this sieve is. I don't have to sieve it, I can just do this. And we're done with the ship. Now we need a pinch of salt. There's a pinch and a half. Good. Emma's the saltiest of my exes. <laughs> whisk, whisk. Oh, fuck. I shouldn't swear so loud. There's kids nearby. I should not have worn a black top underneath this. I am stupid. That looks amazing. I don't know if I'll get salmonella for doing that, but that is bloody banging. Oh, that's beautiful. I don't know why, but raw like stuff, so like cookie dough, batter for cakes and stuff, always tastes better before they're cooked. I spilled a bit of my drink. Cucumber and lemon. I highly recommend it. Oh, sugary things always make me more thirsty. Chocolate chip time. We have milk chocolate and we have dark chocolate. Oh, dropped one. Five second rule. Oh, I just need to stop picking at it now. I feel quite sick. I think my nans are back. More chocolate chips. You can never have too many chocolate chips. Well, we'll find out now anyway. Pre-warning, my nan just pulled up in the car. She may walk in any second. She's coming. Hello. No, no, don't be sorry. It's fine. You can come say hello if you want. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> so awkward. Anyway, so we do not have the little cupcake tins, but we have normal tins, trays, tins. So what we're going to do, we're going to put the cases on and put the thingies in. I can't English. That's three. And then I'm going to put them in with the cases. Oh, so much effort. Ah! Blow it Well, shit, my spoon. How do you even turn the oven on? Is that on? I don't know if the oven's on. I think it's on. I didn't preheat it, so... I'm gonna put it on for about 20 minutes. Yeah. So, update. I have 12 in the oven right now, and I have five here. So, considering I was only one short of 18, which I was aiming to get, I did quite well. Man, I'm done with that. Now, for the butter icing, which we're going to put on top of the cupcakes. I have never made butter icing before. Another challenge. With 150 grams, we need another 150 grams of butter. Oh, they're baking! Why am I so shocked they're baking? I literally put them in the oven. Right, how much is this? Right, we are a bit short on butter. I will be back. I am recording. <laughs> Sorry. Thank you very much. Thanks. I've got the butter. 300 grams of icing sugar. I'm on it. I need the chat again. Seriously, how cool are these converse? Lovely icing sugar. Paco. That's a lot of sugar. 
Wait, how much did I just put in? I'm really confused. I think I've really messed up. It's fine. Ellie can't be good at everything. It's like a dust cloud. You can really see that. But it was like a dust cloud. One teaspoon. We need more vanilla extract. Where's my spoon? Where's my spoon? Pink more salt. Pink more salt. That's not really a pinch. Enjoy. Call me salt bay. Oh, I'm getting it everywhere. This is really bad. Oh my god. I think I've really messed this up. I'm gonna call my nan for some help. I can't make buttercream. I found that out. It's after this. Yeah. <laughs> What you need to do with better rice is to put it in slowly. Oh, I just sort of just chucked it you all in. You should always put it in a bit at a time. So with the help of my nan, you shall now be fixing my life problems. Starting with buttercream. Let me just check my cupcakes. Oh, one's exploding. That doesn't look good. So, that's an issue. Uh-oh. Uh, one sort of gone a bit evil in there. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that's good. But we need a dish. One eternity later. Right. So, little update. What you just saw was me struggling to make buttercream, so I called my nan for assistance. It worked, she did it, it's now in a bowl. Well, some of it's in a bowl. Most of it is in these little cool thingies that you just squeeze out onto cupcakes. The cupcakes are also done cooking. We're gonna wait for them to like cool, but kind of overdid them. They're very messy, but we're going to make them look cooler with the buttercream and my little, little bits on it. Also got a massive sugar rush. I'm like a toddler of anything, like coffee gets to my head straight away. Sugar goes to my head straight away. And alcohol goes straight to my head straight away. Anyway, I'll see you in about three quarters of an hour after those cupcakes have cooled and I've calmed down. Let's get this over with. We've got 10 minutes. Okay, let's go. All right, can we just eat them? The amount of sugar I've consumed today. Egg. Let's put some cupcakes on the plate. Some of them look good. Some of them, eh. Yeah, but they're, they're natural. Yeah. They're... Somehow I put them in three cupcake cases. Oh, right, they're all on the plate, ready to um, decorate. We've got a glicky close of you now. Oh, there's someone here. Hello. I'm here. Oh, it looks lovely. Oh, thank you. So let's first. Put the icing on. Oh, it looks something. Chocolate on this one. Oh, that looks better. I mean, it does look a little bit like a shell. Yeah, just looks like a shell. It's fine. Everyone loves a shell, don't they? That's a mirror. That's like diarrhea. <laughs> okay, that looks. That's a lumpy. I'm really out of focus. I reckon you put the sprinkles on the chocolate ones and the magic stars on the white ones. I don't know if that was a good idea, but I just put them all on. They look pretty. That looks good. Now they don't look like shits. Or they look like shits with stars on them. Let me show you a video close up. See, they look gorgeous. And now we need to put the sprinkles on here. Oh shit! Uh oh. Uh, we had an issue. What? I kind of. Oh. They could brush that. Yeah, the chocolate ones don't look that good. I'll show you. Yeah, no. But like a sprinkly poo. Especially this one. Yeah, and then also that's the mess I just made. And then that's the camera. Hola. So, guys, that's the end of the video. Some of the cupcakes went decent. And then other cupcakes, kind of. But it's okay, as long as some turned out well. Anyway, thanks for watching. This is Crazy Girl Ellie, and I'll see you in the next video.
Wish me luck cleaning up. <laughs> Yo, it's, it's, it's me again. Hi. I just like to give a little quick update. I have, um, I've given out the cupcakes to my fellow neighbours and the feedback was good. So yeah, thanks again for watching. This is Crazy Girl Ellie and I'll see you in the next video.